Now I'm going to talk about your starches. These are sweet potatoes. I like to get them if they're really nice and keep it and bake them and, and um, or microwave them or boil them or whatever and keep the peeling on. But if they're kind of yucky, well then you have to peel them. Turnips are really healthy, but I just, I root, uh, rutabagos or whatever. Um, but I can't, I can't cut them and I can't do anything with them. So if I want them, I buy frozen already peeled and cut. What the heck? You know, I, I, I'm not doing this for healthy people. I'm doing this for people who are chronically ill like me and going to make life easier. And, and I, it'll reverse brain damage, providing you don't forget, you've got to have three okra a day. Now, um, this is not good. I prefer the red. You can see that. I prefer the little red ones. They're okay, but, you know, there's an awful lot of starch, and I can't think of other than potassium what's, what's in a potato that's particularly healthy. I don't fry anything. I mean, I just don't. Um, butternut squash is really delicious and really super healthy, and it's got a lot of vitamin A, just as the uh, sweet potatoes do. So, um, I don't know about the other ones. Um, there's the spaghetti squash, but it has no flavor. And uh, onions, onions kind of go with your veggies, of course. Um, that's all part of your veggie, me veggie meal. A cucumber is a veggie meal. Um, but I find that the ones with the seed uh, cause a great deal of gas and can be acidic if you're already not that well and you've got allergies or immune deficiencies. Um, try to get them seedless. Uh, even the the little ones, uh, the little baby cucumbers are really great, except that they, 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 they all give me uh, cramps. So I have to watch what I eat. And, and you have to learn what's good for you. Okay, everybody's different. No two people are exactly the same. And make sure that you put some uh, garlic. Uh, Mrs. Dash is probably your best bet. Even the doctors in the hospitals will recommend Mrs. Dash. Uh, it's very low in salt and it, it'll, it'll increase flavor and it's also very healthy. You could make a tea with it if you got a cold. Okay, so that's it for now. I'll just give you some ideas. Ciao, see,